In this video, we're gonna be talking about the all new Thor Sentinel LTD Roost Guard Chest Protector for 2023. What is going on guys? Uh, welcome back to another video. Today we're gonna to be talking about the Thor Chest Protector, the brand new one, the LTD for 2023. And I wanted to make this video because I haven't seen any other videos uh, out there on this chest protector that are in English. So uh, I wanted to buy one of these and there weren't any videos out there to really talking about. So uh, I wanna go over some key points, some things that I like about it, some things I don't like about it. Uh, so you guys can make a informed decision if you wanna buy one of these or not. All right, so I bought this from cyclegear.com. I paid $119.95 for it. It comes in two different models and a bunch of different colors. I got the white one here. It comes in black, white, red, and blue, I believe. And this is the full back version. Uh, so there is the race version that has just a small slit of plastic down the back. This is the regular version that has the full back on the, uh, the rear side of it. It gives you more protection and whatnot, but the race version is basically for people that just want the front roost guard. This full version is for people that want protection on the back from any other type of incidents that you might have. Um, but there is a price difference. The race version is $89.95. So this one was a little bit more expensive just because you're getting more material on the back. All right, so let's talk about some things I like about this thing. It is super vented. There are these hexagonal holes all throughout the entire chest protector. It lets a lot of airflow come through um, and it really makes for a nice light design and I really do like it. So the material it's made up of is a hard plastic, um, it, but it forms to your chest very nicely. So there are these side flaps on either side that when you tighten it, it wraps around, gives you a lot of good coverage. And a lot of the other chest protectors that I've been looking at are just more of the front. They don't really have the side protection on it. Uh, if you take a bar into the side of the ribs or anything like that, this is gonna give you a little bit more protection than what the other guys are offering. So the third thing I really like about this is the ratcheting straps, uh, or if you wanna call it that. They go in to the side and they click. Almost like a, uh, an Alpine Star Tech 7 boot. Uh, but it makes it really easy to put them in, makes it really easy to take them out. You just push this button, they come right out. All right, so on to probably the only thing I don't really like about this chest protector is that it's not CE certified, which I don't really understand what that means, other than the fact that CE certified equals more protection within a crash. So this is a pretty light, slim roost guard slash chest protector. It's gonna protect you from the roost, rocks, and whatnot. Uh, if you take a bar to the chest, it's definitely gonna add some protection, offer some protection there, uh, but it's not gonna be up to the level of something like, something like this. This is my Liat 3.5 external chest protector. This thing is rock solid, it's CE certified. It's definitely a lot more heavy duty than the Thor Sentinel. Um, just a lot, a lot thicker. You're, this weighs a lot more, this is a lot lighter. If you're going for something that can go under the jersey, uh, be a little bit more discreet, but still offer protection, this is what you want to go with. If you don't mind looking like an exoskeleton, um, this is what you want to go with. Uh, but this thing's a little heavy, a little cumbersome, and I'm excited to be able to try out the new Thor Sentinel being a little bit lighter and whatnot. All right, so I'm gonna show you guys the fit. This is under the jersey. Now, to keep in mind, I am 165 pounds and I wear a size medium jersey, and this Thor Sentinel is the medium large size. So this is what you guys are gonna get under the jersey. All right, so now this is what the chest protector is gonna look like over top of the jersey. So all in all, I got to wear this over the last weekend. We rode a little bit and I wore the Thor Sentinel LTD and I was really impressed with it. It's nice, it's light, it's very well ventilated. Uh, it didn't get too hot, it didn't give me any weird rashes and whatnot. I wear a shirt underneath it, um, but I would definitely recommend this if you guys are thinking about picking one up. This is brand new out for 2023 and is the Thor Sentinel LTD. Like I said, I got this at cyclegear.com. It's available at a couple other places, but if you're thinking about it, I would definitely recommend it. Well, thanks for watching guys. Hopefully this helped. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and we'll see you guys in the next one real, real soon.